Hey everyone, Lensmanos here, and welcome back to Kingdom Come, Kingdom Come Deliverance. So, left up last episode with uh, Henry and Father Godwin here, uh, getting on the drink a bit, and uh, now, rather hungover, I believe we're going to go and do a sermon. So, this should be quite interesting. Uh, apparently it's, it's time for a sermon. Reputation lost. Hmm. Great fun. Here we go. I thought he'd never show up. The swill pup. Look at him. He can hardly walk after his capers last night. Awesome. You were with him, you beast. Just you. Throw up. I couldn't sleep a wink last night with all that clamor. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Accepit panem in sanctas. At venerabiles a manus suas. <clears throat> Hac facite in meam commemorationem. Brothers and sisters, you may have had the honor of meeting Henry from Scalitz, who is here at the behest of Sir Hanush to investigate that heinous crime at Neuhof. You might not know that Henry recently visited Prague, where, by the grace of God, was able to hear Master Jan Hus from the esteemed Charles University preaching. I've managed to persuade Henry to stand here today in my stead <laughs> and tell this us be funny. what he heard. Because, as you all probably know, Jan Hus is a very popular preacher in Prague. So, Henry, you may begin. This is going to be go. Here we go. All right. Do it with... Uh, we're already at negative two. <clears throat> Do it modest. Uh, brothers and sisters in Christ, I would... Uh, uh, I would like to talk to you about our Holy Mother Church and what iniquities it's declining into. That well wants to preach about the church. Um. Creation has given to every man the power know. by which he might rule the whole world. But that power does not give him the right to rule. That right belongs to God alone. <coughs> I don't know, we're already pretty bad. It's just... No. Uh, it is the it anyway. corruption of God's pastors here on earth that has brought misfortune on our heads. Uh, plague, humans, <laughs> we're, hunger, we're throwing the pastor in the, under the bus. Chaos. And it is all due to um, <clears throat> the corrupt servants of God who do not practice what they preach. They think sins can be washed away by money. And they sell indulgences, and, and that, that's bad. Because sins cannot be redeemed with silver. Prague didn't do much for his confidence. Yeah, that's true. It is the custom of the gluttonous prelates and monks to preach against sin. But what do they know of us ordinary folk? Let us remember the marriage at Cana, where our Lord Jesus Christ himself 
feasted with the other guests and drank his fill. And when the wine was gone, he performed a miracle and created more. He, whose companions were poor travellers, simple folk, prostitutes and troublemakers, performed a miracle so the feast could continue. Now that's the kind of sermon I like to hear. No, brothers and sisters. Jesus did not condemn alcohol. Drink to lighten the cross you bear in this veil of tears, but not with such abandon that you cannot keep holy the Sabbath. For there should be moderation in all things, and it is not drinking itself that is sinful, but intemperance and beastly indulgence. He's right! Um... I don't know. Gonna go Enough modestly. about sin, which the prelates are so fond of preaching about, and whose absolution they promise if you only pay enough coin to Mother Church. Look at them. They, they, they booze like hypocrites and, and, and buy expensive jewels. They, they servants of God. And, and, and that is not right because, because Christ preached poverty. And only poverty and temperance are true virtues. And it was almost getting oh, I should have gone into the, uh... Uh... God sees what is happening on earth, and he is filled with righteous wrath that those who should seek the salvation of souls instead seek mammon and the idle comfort of lucrative posts. Blessed are the shepherds who share the poverty of their flock, who are as one with you, and bear with you the burden of this earthly pilgrimage, who do not condemn your venial sins. Aye, all honour to Godwin. Let him drink like one of us. That is all I heard in Prague. <laughs> Didn't do <Amen>. so great. <laughs> Pretty terrible. Pretty terrible. Have you no shame, you pair of buffoons? I'll be writing to the bishop of this. For shame. Utterly blasphemous. Can you believe such behavior? For men of the cloth to get drunk at church. Oh well. Almost worked. Worth the trial. So, is our deal still on? Are you pulling my fucking pizzle? I couldn't have done worse myself if I'd puked on the altar. Well, I'm no preacher. Yeah, I noticed. And I wasn't the only one. You can't be serious. After all that. All what? All you making a complete hash of my sermon? You were supposed to help, not get me into even more trouble. Now I'll have the bishop on my back and all the villagers. Just leave. I need to pull myself together. And what am I supposed to do? Find someone else to help you. Awesome. Oh well, guess we uh, failed that crystal on. Yeah, so what now, I guess? Let's look at our... Uh, I wonder if anyone has anything about him. It's just like we're, we're now stuck with... We'll go back to the bailiff. I guess. Oh well, worth a try, right? Let's check the map. Map, thank you. Come on. Uh, the bailiffs here, aren't they? In the, with the scribe. I don't know why I've got that marked, but that's cool. Uh, let's see. He was over here somewhere. Guess I should have started out with like uh, the anger piece, you know, like confidence. Just gone up there and just winged it. The villager. Scribe, I need to find the bailiff. Hello? Not something I can pick up, I guess. Now I've got to try and find the people I need, that'll be great. 
skeleton. No. God be with you. Yeah, I think he doesn't know anything. Alright, well. Need to find this guy now and then uh I just him here. Good day to you. What do you need? Godwin won't tell me who Lubosh's cronies were. I've reached a complete standstill. Don't even mention that so-called priest. He knocked out one of my teeth yesterday, and you were there with him. I ought to clap you in the stocks. <laughs> I'll go willingly if you stick Godwin next to me. It'd be worth it just to see him suffer. I can well imagine. I've already told you nobody came here to see him. But now it occurs to me. I did hear he was tried in Rate for some mischief or other. Maybe you can find out something there. The scribe might have made a record of it. Thanks, Bailiff. I never thought of that. And let me give you another piece of advice. Don't go boozing with Godwin again. Take care now. And maybe that was never going to happen. Through the Rate Black Chronicle for any record of Lubosh. Um, Alright. No, don't crouch. All the horse. So I'm going to jump on my horse here. Do I go and do the witch thing? Because that was another quest line that we had here. I mean, I don't really want to help Goblin out anymore because obviously... We could do it. Yeah, that's... Yeah, I wanna I wanna go to this one. Main track three. Okay, fair enough. But all right. I don't know. Can you show on the map? Maybe I can just walk there. Oh. The fair way out. Okay. <laughs> I need to go like out here. Oh, let's try that. We'll do that on the way. Shouldn't be that far away. We'll give the horse yeah. a bit of a run. Actually wears out a bit. Just got a fair bit of stamina. There's a person. Wayfarer. Come on. Sorry, buddy. Run you over with the horse. Yeah. The trees now. Whoa. Really nifty, like paths through the forest here and the scenery is quite quite impressive. What are you doing, pal? Who are you? Some sort of trapper or something. The wayfarer. Right, how much further we got? Let's check the map again. Ah, that's probably see where we're going. We'll continue up this path a little bit further. Come on, buddy. Yeah, I'm, I'm right next to him. Just get on. Jeez. Yeah. Oh, apparently I got a headache. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I'm assuming I have a headache. Just by the little uh, thing down there in the corner. 
weapons roll. Where's my, oh, my clothes. Um, like, where's my gear? Got none of my stuff on. Run around in my underwear. I don't know if this is my best stuff, but I'm assuming that the stuff I've still got in my inventory is the stuff I was wearing. I'm at the padded one. No, I don't think I want that one. No. What's the defense is five. The other one is six. Bow, some arrows, just use the poor quality ones for now. I think that's everything. I have gloves on? Yes. Alright, better than nothing, right? Let's talk to the herb woman. Good afternoon. I come in the name of Sir Hanish of Lyper. I'm investigating the massacre in Neuhof, and now a murder here as well. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask all you want, lad. Who was this Lubosh who was murdered? Let's just sort of Those skip through that a bit. Live by the sword, die by the sword. Uh, Have you noticed anything suspicious recently? Everything about him was suspicious. I always gave him a wide berth. Fair enough. Do you know what Lubosh was doing the day Neuhoff was raided? How would I know? Do you know who Lubosh I don't know! Okay, cool. That's all. But she knows he was in the owl house, see, since I don't go to owl houses. I've come from the priests. They're saying you incited some women to witchcraft. Me? Witchcraft? That's nothing but idle chatter. You'd be wise to give me a straight answer. I mean you no harm. As long as it's the truth you speak. Very well. I'll tell you everything. I've done a very foolish thing. It's preying on my mind so much I can't sleep a wink. But I'm supposed to believe an old witch has pangs of conscience. Laugh if you like, but it's not a word of a lie. You probably know I sell various magic lotions and potions alongside my herbs. Well, there's one I wish I hadn't sold. You see, Vera's life. Done, fine ringing. Uh, right. So, what ointment what was kind it? What ointment was it? One that will show you a world no one else can see. A place of wonder and terror. The flowers might start talking to you, or the earth could swallow you up. I don't know if it's the work of the devil or of God himself, but the ointment has that power. But it could poison any person who doesn't know how to use it right. So all this talk of witches anointing themselves and then flying to their sabbaths on broomsticks... The ointment could make a person see such things. But it was stupid of me letting those foolish women get their hands on it. They could poison themselves or fall off a cliff while they're lost in a dream. So they're stoned. Will you give me the ointment recipe? It contains belladonna and the herb Paris, both quite poisonous plants. That ought to make you think twice about dabbling with it. So why did you give them the ointment at all? Because I'm soft-hearted. You see, one of those women, Vera, lost her whole family in Skalitz. And Zlata's husband was killed. And the youngest of them, Kuta, miscarried with the horror of it all. They said they wanted to use the ointment to speak with the dead and ask them to put a word in with the Lord. Yeah. I understand how they feel. But I reckon it'll get them nowhere but the ducking stool and the stake. Judge not, lest ye be judged. 
I didn't want to give them the ointment, but they offered me a pile of groschen. So I thought how desperate they must be, and I heard their plea. Their plea or the clink of their coin? And why are you so worried about them all of a sudden? What changed your mind? I'm losing sleep over it. Firstly, those women don't know what they're doing. And secondly, folk might see it as witchcraft. And do you know what they do to witches? They burn them alive. That they do. So don't be surprised I'm worried. It didn't bother you before, though. What did they want the ointment for? Each one of them lost a loved one recently, and it's grieving them. Yep, one had a bit. I've heard enough. If you've heard enough, you must understand why I need your help. Find out. Yep. Whatever. Very well. Thank you a thousandfold. I'll go to the Reverend myself. God bless. Um, can you actually give me training? Is it possible? Would you teach me something about medicinal herbs? Certainly. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. Whatever. Now, pay close attention. God. Just improves herbalism for me. Alchemy bench, eh? in here uh -huh. interesting so that's I can't even read that oh, push E duh one nettle and two belladonna wow boil the nettles for two turns Grind the bell, Donna. Drop in the bell, Donna. Boil. Spelling mistake. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. It's, oh, it's me reading, isn't it? That's right. Whoever drinks the potion shall save his game and his soul. Oh, uh, yes. Looking around. Just seeing what's here. Because I've, I've probably got some stuff, but I doubt I've got Belladonna. Yeah, that's cool. Interesting. Yeah, escape. Let's step back. I mean, she may have stuff growing around. Got a nice little hatch of herbs up here. What's this? Oh, collectors? No? No, so for some reason I can't. No, there's a nettle. A few nettles here. Take a couple of these and we'll see if we can brew something. Just don't know if the belladonna's around. I'm not sure what that looks like. Yeah, just lots of nettles. They're walking through the trees. What I need to do is walk with my head down and see if things flash up as I'm walking. Alright, so I guess the next step is to go back, uh, go back and do that next quest. I like pie. Okay. Uh, buy. Well, she does have it. It's expect. Oh well. I don't know. Three point four. It's okay. Let's just buy two of them. Can I sell her anything? Not really. Oh. So if we go inside, let's see if we can brew this potion. Just for giggles. Got a few nettles. Pretty sure it was. Read the book. 
One nettle, two belladonna. Okay. Prepare wine and two handfuls of belladonna and one nettle. Boil the nettles for two turns. Grind the belladonna. Uh, wine. Okay. Inventory. Nettles. Select. Select. Okay. Uh, a grindstone or something? Ah, oh, the mortar. So I need... Nettles. One. Um, I need Belladonna. Oh, it was only one medal, isn't it? Ah, that's funny. And let's reset. Wine. Do it properly. One lot of nettle. Otherwise, I would ruin it, right? Inventory. Select. Select and select. Cool. So I want one of them. I need to light the fire. Uh, Q for bellows. Uh, sand glass. One turn. Uh, get the it's two turns. Fellows. No. Nope. Oh yeah, I was gonna say. And one more of these. In there. Around it. Let's see what happens. Hmm? Yeah, is it working? I'm just guessing here, right? And boil for one more turn. Okay, so... Uh, bellows. Uh, F? No. Yeah, put that down. Uh, Q for the bellows. F for the sand glass. F. I don't know, should it change colour or something? I'm just winging it here. Sure, whatever. Complete it. It's probably wrong. I brewed it! Yay! <laughs> oh my gosh. Talk about one heck of a uh, convoluted way of doing things. I'd rather buy it. That's cool. Apparently I brewed it. Apparently I'm hungry. Probably have no food on me. Have a look. No, I've got this one. Let's eat that. And then let's go back to... Rate, I guess. What do I need to... I've got to find those, those women, don't I? Okay, so I... 
Probably need to. You know what? Okay, let's go off. We're gonna go all the way back here. Um. Hey. Okay. Oh, still got the executioner's thing I've got to do. I'll probably untrack that quest, actually. Let's go into quest log. Let's. Can I unshow that? Speak to the village room about. Magical appointment. That's here. Okay. Map. I want to go like here, somewhere. Head back. Yeah. Ooh, helps if I look at the front, of course, as we're running. Some trees. Who knows what we'll find. Head's still pounding apparently. There, horse. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it's a little hut. Interesting side, huh? What is the interesting side about? What's so interesting? Kind of wine. Hey. And some blood on it. Oh, there's someone's been getting a little frisky out here, maybe. Alrighty, let's continue on. Take the stuff you've left behind. No wine for you, my friend. Yeah. Oh, is that where we're meant to be? Okay, map. Journal. Oh, so what now it's... Here we go. These three. C. I need to go to that point. Okay, so far into town. We can do that. Range anyone? Turn the corner. Good steering on this uh, this horse. Probably shouldn't have come in here. Jump. <laughs> All right, out here somewhere. Let's jump the fence. Oh, crash! Sorry, horse. I'm getting out. Yep, that's parking it on a hill. Who is it? Uh, is one of the people we need in here? Zoom in a bit. Okay, let's go back to quest log. It'd be nice to. No. Okay, so we've got one uh, over here somewhere. Any closer? Who is it? No, who is it? You tell me. Oh, I should stop trying to run. Maybe this is one out here. 
You one of the people? Yep, that's one of them. Hey, talking to you. I've heard something about a magical ointment. Really? I'd like to know where from. And what concern is it of yours anyway? The herb woman sent me. Gertrude? What does she want? More money? It's not about the money. She's concerned about your health. That ointment can be dangerous, and she wants me to make sure you don't do anything foolish. <laughs> it can't have got any more dangerous since she sold it to us. Tell her we're ever so grateful for her concern, and goodbye. Alright, that's one fail. Uh, the next one was down here somewhere, wasn't it? Journal. Yeah, let's go to that field. What's going on? Nothing, mate. Nothing. He's running around everywhere. He walks so slowly. Just running and jumping over fences. <laughs> hey, I'm just here in your town. One of these three. Nope. What was yep. that noise? Hello. Talking to you. I heard something about a magic. You yep. heard that where? Hey. The herb yep. woman sent me. Gertrude? What is she? Yeah. She'd like to know just what you're planning to do. What made her change her tune? You can tell her we plan to do exactly what we agreed. Yeah. Follow the women to the woods. Okay, so that's. I need to sleep though. He's tired. Um. So journal. Oh, could I actually physically follow the women? Do their points move on the map? Yes. Oop, I don't know what I'm doing here. Yeah. Hey, who's there? I'm here. What's your problem? I guess I'd. If I had a nap, and someone to nap would be good. Me, wash yourself. Alright, I think I'm going to have to call it here and uh, pick up next time. So, thanks everyone for watching. Please leave your comments below. Sorry of my botched attempts at herbalism there. Um, pretty, pretty terrible and failing that quest. I, I really should have just been more confident and just, I don't know, dribbled some stuff. But for now, thank you again and I'll see you next time. Bye now.